Hey guys, what is up? What is going on, my friends of YouTube? It's Sergio here with Takeover Clock, and in today's video, well, once again, we're taking a look at another microphone. This one is from the brand Phoenix Pro. Phoenix with the Y before the X. It's a wireless microphone system. It's UHF, designed with 30 adjustable frequency sets. And we'll get to that in a minute. But right now you're listening to me recording the microphone. Let me explain to you right quick what's in the box. We have the receiver. We got the handheld microphone, the one that I'm using right now. We got a body pack transmitter. We have a headset microphone. We got a lapel microphone as well. And we have two antennas already hooked up to the receiver. We have the power adapter. We have one one quarter inch uh, TRS audio cable. And we got the user manual and we have a carrying case. I'm going to leave some of the specifications down below in the description. So I don't want to bore you with a whole bunch of numbers that probably don't matter to you anyways. So I will have that information in the description. So right now you are listening to the sound quality of the microphone. There's no post processing. Let me explain to you how I have it connected. So right now I have it connected directly into my Focusrite 2i2 for my interface and then it's going into the computer with my Reaper software and from there it's coming out of the headphone to a splitter and then from here it's going to the DSLR at 3.5 millimeters. So that is how you're listening to me right now. Though I do want to give you heads up, you need a pop filter because of the plosives that we get when we do the plosive test. So when you're gonna be speaking into the microphone, you either boost up the volume too loud to uh, increase the gain, or if you want to use a proximity effect, you might want to use a pop filter for all those plosives, for all the plosives that you might get. Let's talk about the receiver right quick. Well, one thing that I am impressed with, it's the self noise, uh, the preamps. Uh, I am very impressed with that. It's nearly to no noise. It, it sounds crispy, it sounds really, really good, and there's not a whole lot of background noise. I'm gonna do a quiet test now. And as you can hear, as you can hear, as you can hear, there's not a whole lot of uh, background noise. So that is something really, really nice from the receiver. In the face of the receiver, we got the brand, which is Phoenix Pro, the PTU-52. On the left, we got the power button, and then we have a volume knob that it's divided. And the volume knob is for the headset, for the transmitter, the, the body pack. And on the right, the channel B, it's um, for this handheld microphone. You can uh, regulate the volume. You can change the volume to each separate individual. In the back of the uh, receiver, all right, let me go to the back right quick. We have uh, the antennas. All right, and then we have the uh, power connector. We have the TRS uh, mix output, or we have two separate uh, balance XLR outputs for individual channels. Like if you want to take this to a mixer and you want to have this microphone separate from uh, the other microphone on its own channel. That is why I call it, or that's why it's called dual channel. That means that there's like two receivers in one. That's very, very cool. The LCD, it's divided in two again, channel A and channel B. Uh, we can see that we have the antenna frequency. We got the mute button. We got the channel. And it tells us it reads the frequency. And at the bottom, there's a uh, there's the volume meter that tells you if you're getting signal from the microphone into the transmitter i mean into the receiver now you've been listening to this audio fully raw like there's no eq applied to it there's nothing done to it i will probably boost up the volume in post just in case it's not loud enough so right now i'm using a, a bst plugin on my software it's called vocal finalizer and a little tip that i can give you guys if you want to make this sound like this really pro this bst has delay, it has reverb, and it has a doubler. It also has compressor, it has EQ, and it has a stereo width. Man, this plugin, it's, and it's only $29, really cheap. 
almost dirt free and it sounds really good. You can actually go from like I'm doing right now if you're a DJ and if you want to have this type of effects to make a microphone like this, like the, the post-processing, the EQ, the, the mastering to sound really crisp and beautiful. Man, I'm telling you, I am impressed by the sound quality of this microphone. It sounds, it, it just sounds good. It sounds pro. Okay, so I am now using the headband microphone and there is where we have a problem. The adjustable arm, it has the microphone facing up. And let me show you right quick. I don't know if you can see that, but the microphone is facing up. It's not facing me. Now I'm going to turn it. Hello, now, now the microphone is facing me. Now the microphone is facing me. But what happens with that? I am very not satisfied. I am not happy with the way that the microphone it's facing it's facing up all right and it comes in with this wind muff and this wind muff it doesn't have any shape or form i mean it's just round okay it's just round and it goes over the microphone but when it goes over the microphone the microphone goes up and i don't know where it's facing in that right there's a problem can you tell where the microphone is facing because it's not facing my mouth, I tell you that. I have to feel it, and I have to turn it, and when I when I adjust the microphone, uh, it goes right back to it. This needs to be fixed. It needs to be a permanent shape look to it. Um, I am not happy with it, I don't like it. So Phoenix Pro, you guys have to fix it. Okay guys, this is a lavalier microphone. You are listening to the quality, you be the judge. Uh, the uh, transmitter, the body pack also has an LCD screen that shows the frequency. You can also change the volume up and down. You can also change the channel, what channel you wanna be on. Uh, it has two AA batteries. It has the antenna at the top. It has the mute button at the top and the power button built in in the same. Uh, to power it off, you hold it for about five seconds. To mute it, you tap it once and it's muted. And we also got the uh, 3.5 millimeter connector with the lock. It locks into it. You twist it and it locks and it's really cool. Now let's go back to my favorite. My favorite of all time when it comes to this kit, it's this microphone. The microphone, the handheld, it sounds really, really good. Let me take some of these effects away. Uh, let me take down the delay a little bit, the reverb. Just bring it down just a little bit. Let me increase a little bit of brightness. Uh, let me remove a little bit of the body right there. Let me increase a little bit of the width. And guys, with that said, let's go ahead and take a look at some of the things in the microphone. Well, there is a power button there. If you press it once, it's to mute it. If you press it for about three to five seconds, it will shut off the microphone. We got some physical buttons at the bottom too. We got the set to change the frequency channel. And we also got the plus and minus volume buttons. There's an LCD screen that indicates also the frequency and it indicates the channel that you're on is channel B. It says right here, channel B as well. And it just sounds Really, really good. Let me bring down the, let me just get rid of the delay. Now, one, two, three. One, two, three. Now we only got a little bit of reverb. And man, I gotta tell you, this microphone sounds really, really good. This whole kit, it's worth the money if you wanna use it for like, you're starting a church, you're starting a speech or commentary for whatever you're gonna use or like a DJ or a party that you're gonna be hosting, you want something quick. Uh, but also pro sounding quality. Well, this right here would not let you down. I recommend using, once again, I recommend using a, a wind muff or pop filter for the plusives because you can hear the difference. Plusives, 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 plusives. You get the point. This was your host, Sergio Takeover Clock, once again, reviewing another microphone and giving it thumbs up. The headband, it's questionable, but it's there. Is this worth your money? No questions asked. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.